hello guys how are you uh, first of all i would like to thank you so much to all for helping me supporting me and motivating me by watching my videos and subscribing my channel today i will help you that how to prepare income statement by using the multi step income statement format in excel spreadsheet because some day ago uh, one friend who asked me that how to prepare uh, income statement so i'm going to uh, prepare it and guys uh, if you have any query too please ask me in the comment box below now guys uh, let's start before i start to prepare it i think we have to give the um, answer of these um, questions i hope all of you have the answer of these questions however i'm going to tell you uh, the answer of these questions so please watch till the end otherwise you will not understand about that okay all right so let's start from one that what is income statement yeah from my point of view and uh, uh, generally the income statement describes about the whole activities um which are occurred in um, trading accounts and profit and loss accounts right it is uh, the just advanced form of pl or trading account right so this these things now let's move on to the another question is that how many method to prepare the income statement and what are they yes so basically there are two types of um, method to prepare the income statement and uh, the first one is that single step income statement and the second one is that multi step income statement right okay so why is is it prepared third one is that okay so the answer is that uh, to prepare due to the reason are to identify the cost of goods sold to identify the gross profit to identify the operating ex expenses to identify the profit from operation to identify the other incomes and losses and to identify the net profit after tax right so th these are the basic objectives that determine to prepare these things right okay so okay guys we answered uh, of all the questions now let's further better um to clarify it by taking an example okay so all right uh, this is the questions right uh, uh, we will take these questions as an example that helps us to better clarify it okay so this this table uh, is a historical or assumed all right this is not uh, accurate value all right uh, i have just uh, used uh, this amount based on their criteria okay uh, so it will not affect for our task okay so so before i start to uh, prepare it we should know their format that is uh, n uh, we should know about uh, the multi step income statement format then we can use these transaction data okay so let's see all right so um, this is the uh, format of uh, income statement under multi step okay you can see here and this is the uh, questions i have just copied from one to another sheet right and uh, we will use this transaction data to complete this form based on their criteria and their na natures nature of um, transaction okay so now uh, let me tell you i have already uh, used the formula of sum uh, to get the total amount um of these sections all right you can see here in the top of and uh, this is doesn't just uh, a simple formula you can see here uh sham function here uh you can use this 
function two. All right. Okay. Now let's follow this. Uh, follow the format of incoming statement or this format and put this data into this form. Right. So so let's start. So here, uh, let's check this out. Uh, sales revenue. How much? Let's see in this table. So how much? One lakh rupees. So right here, one lakh rupees. Press the enter key. Okay and uh, subtract sales return from sales so how much sales return here one one thousand right here and press the enter key okay so we we got uh net sales ninety nine thousand all right okay so now let's find the cost of goods sold from this table so how much yes forty five thousand one hundred and press the enter key okay all right so gross profit is fifty three thousand nine hundred okay now let's um, find the operating expenses based on uh, this criteria office and administrative expenses and selling and distribution expenses or oh, actually the operating expenses is the submission of the office and administrative expenses and selling and um, distribution expenses right Office and administrative expenses are day-to-day -day activities, activities which are required the money to run the organization, right? Similarly, the selling and distribution expenses uh, are related to the marketing and sales activities to promote your brand, product, etc. Alright? So, uh, it was just a um, brief meaning of these two terms, right? So, let's continue it. So uh, f first, uh, uh, let's uh, find the office and administrative uh, expenses from this table. So right here, so salaries, how much? Uh, Ten thousand. Press the enter key, uh, and another one is purchase of fixed assets. How much? Two hundred. Press the enter key, and so on. All right, I've done. Okay, now uh, let's uh, find selling and distribution expenses from this table. I think uh, there is no any transaction data related to these uh, expenses, so let's uh, skip it. Uh, uh, yeah, but uh, if you want to add something, then uh, press uh, any dash or sample here suppose here and uh, skip it and press the zero all right okay and right here some function in the uh, in these uh, two cell right you can see in the formula bar above all right now uh, let's find the other revenues and gain other end revenue scan uh, means uh, uh, those transactions which are not really exact related to these two activities that is office and ad administrative ex exp uh, expenses and selling and distribution expenses all right uh, <coughs> so let's find it all right so these uh, stated uh, color uh, area represents the other revenue and gains transaction so right here what is this uh, receipt received uh, from customers customers how much 2800 press the enter key and uh, another one is sales of fixed assets right here all right i have done okay now uh, let's find the other expenses and losses same as uh, other revenue as gain but a uh, little bit difference it is a uh, revenue or it is um, expenses that's why uh, these two terms are different each other so let's find it what is this loss on sale of fixed assets all right you can see here all right so right here loss on sale of fixed assets how much a t all right i have already written here okay 
now uh, click here and write the formula you can see in the formula bar box I've already used this plus this minus this equals to total value net uh, as a net profit before tax and now let's find the income tax expenses all right we have income tax expenses 250 right here and press the enter key okay we have found 42,250 which is our actual net profit after tax so I have done I have completed this form and I have found the net profit by using the multi-step income statement method so guys uh, this is very simple to prepare it and uh, easily we can ident identify each criteria of uh, in uh, multi-step income statement suppose gross profit uh, profit from operation net profit after tax and so on all right so this is very simple to prepare it um that's all for now thanks for watching if you like this video please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel and please hit the notification icon if you have any comments then write the comment in the comment box below thank you so much once again bye bye